Oh, can y'all see me? Ah! <laughs> we about to get out the house. Oh, so I just threw some on, child, because my stuff don't fit. I put on a sweater. These tights I got at uh, Tory. My sister put me on to Tory tights. I think I got a size one or whatever. And then my little Ugg boots. And listen, I'm already out of breath, child. I have no idea where we going, but uh, Mama is ready. So, yeah, I hope it's not raining. So where you said we going? Uh, to the outlet. <laughs> so if we go to the outlet, if we get there and there's too many people, then we just go, what, go get something to eat? Yeah. <laughs> Ask you a personal question. Not a personal question, but like from a man's perspective. Mm. Okay. Wait a minute. Am I recording? Yeah. So, me and Adrian were having a discussion about men, some men who are married that don't post their wives on like Facebook or Instagram or whatever. So, my question is why get married or be in a serious relationship if you don't want to post? Like, you post pictures by yourself. You know what I mean? So, why do you think, people, why do you think guys do that, boo? Want to make sure they still got it. You know, they like showing off their stuff. <laughs> some are jealous, maybe. They don't want to show off their wife. And maybe some just still living their life of being single. So, I mean, it's all about appearance. So, I don't know. That's what I would say. I would say if a dude don't want to post his wife and let people know that he's married, or like only a certain people, it's not around a certain amount of people know, then it's because he married but still looking, or married and still want to kick it or whatever. I would have never thought that maybe he was like jealous. You know, and I want people to see his wife. Yeah. That's a good point. Yeah, yeah I that's, never thought about that. That's why I asked you. A lot more than you think. A man's perspective. Okay, I never thought about that. By the way. I Y'all, it is raining. It ain't raining hard, but it's cold. We only went in one store and we already about to go. I'm hungry. Yes, I want a cookie. <laughs> Can I get, um, you said a peanut butter cookie? So one peanut butter cookie and two original chocolate chip cookies. Can I get a That's it. short we went to um the alley mall and grand period we only went to a couple stores they didn't really have nothing it's like a lot of the stores when well, i ain't gonna say a lot the ones we went to it looked like they had jacked up the prices just so they could bring them down and then it was cold it was raining i think we went like three places um 
went to Chili's and got something to eat. The Chili's was actually really good. So the food was hidden and I was just tired. Like I got home and what I do? Me and Cam just laid down for a little while. Adrian did too. And then after that, um, I think we just chilled. But Cam is in the bed. Adrian is going to work. And I'm tired, breathing hard. But anyways, I got this Amazon package. And um, I get packages from Amazon like maybe every day to every other day. I really don't know anything. I just said, you know what? I'll just open it on camera. And we can all just see what's in it at the same time. How about that? How about that? Uh -uh. Oh, but yeah, y'all, I'll be tired. I'll be out of breath, especially going up and down the stairs. Oh, Jesus. Like, I have to go upstairs. Cam's room is upstairs, so I have to go upstairs every single morning to, like, get him up, bring him downstairs. I just started bringing his clothes and stuff downstairs and get him ready downstairs for school because... Upstairs ain't no joke. Oh, okay. So I got a. I hope this work. This is a hiccupook, hiccupop, child. I don't know. But anyways, it's a sleep bumper. So a sleep bumper is like um for younger kids when they sleep in a regular size bed. Y'all know kids sleep wild. Well. Now that Cam was one of those kids. Right now he is in a smaller bed, but he's getting so long, like he's basically outgrowing it. So we're gonna give him a full size bed that we already have in the house and the little bumper thing we'll just we haven't decided if we're gonna push the ball the, the ball the bed up against the wall or if we're gonna have it facing the tv either way i just bought one of these because i wanted to try it out first but the bumper will go like if this is the bed the bumper will go along the edge of the bed so when he rolling and moving around he won't you know fall on the floor or whatever so that's what this is, this is. And I forgot that I had with this. So I got a bumper. Oh, there's only one other thing in here. I hope this is my... Well, no. I, really not. I had ordered this... Um, I said I was going to start doing like sheet masks on my face. Because when I get... What is, this, this is the second time I've been pregnant. But I noticed that I get a lot of acne like around this... But like the jawline of my face. And my face is like really, really dry. So I said I would start trying masks. I don't like the mask, the, the peel off mask, and I don't like the the other ones that you spray it on, you have to wash off. I like sheet masks. Lay it on your face, you take it off. So I was looking for something to put my sheet mask in. And I had ordered an acrylic thing. I'm hoping that's what this is. But I don't want it to be too big though because I really don't have that much space. Um, on my bathroom counter for it to be really big child so let's see jeez louise come on all this for this i guess i'm gonna make sure it didn't break okay okay so this is what it is it's a little bigger than i expected oh yeah it's a lot bigger than i expected so i wanted it to be this size i'm cool with this size but i thought it was gonna be like a little shorter not as high but this is fine so i think that'll work so yeah i'm just gonna put um my sheet mask in here like i have a lot of single sheet masks some i have like coming like a pack of four a pack of five or something like that but i'm gonna put them in here and i think what i'm gonna do is just um start like reviewing them like try different types different brands and stuff like that and just see which one that i like the best so Oh man. So, all in all, y'all, today was a pretty chill day. Um, I'm just glad that we got a chance to get out of the house because with this weather, y'all may be getting a lot of um talking inside the house, baby, instead of me staying traveling because it's cold outside and I don't like being cold. But um yeah it was pretty low-key like i said i'm tired um dehydrated i drink water all the time but my lips and stuff still be really chapped. so i guess maybe the baby drinking all the water i don't know but anyway so i'm just gonna end it right here so i can go fix me some more ice cold water and get in the bed so see y'all tomorrow bye